hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is veronica if you're new and this is my little sleepy head emma and for today's video we're going to be doing just like a little nighttime uh, routine i guess i don't even know if i would call it routine i would call it solo night because it's just me and emma today i don't have adrian today he's with his dad and anthony is at work tonight so if you don't know my family, this is the first time stepping in. Anthony is my husband and Adrian is my son, my older son. And um, so we don't have both of the men in the life today. It's just me and the little munchkin right now. So Emma's already tired. It's already seven o'clock. So I'm gonna get ready to put her down to sleep. And then um, I do need to clean up a little bit. And then from there, wanted to sit down. <laughs> relax and read the bible so let's go ahead and get this night or let's go ahead and unwind today guys don't mind the mess in the back because <laughs> i always have a huge mess it's my life my life anyways when i went to the lifeway christian store um on saturday we went back again at night with my husband and i ended up purchasing this one for emma um it was 9.99 originally but i i only paid four dollars for it so i'm gonna go ahead and read that one to emma and then we're gonna go ahead and get her ready for bed she is super tired, by the way, because last night she did not go to sleep properly until uh, 4 o'clock in the morning. So, yeah, I only had two hours of sleep last night. Okay, so it says, found. God is my shepherd and I am his little lamb. Just in case you guys want to see. He feeds me. He guides me. He looks after me. I have everything I need. Oh no, baby, you're tired. Inside my heart is very quiet. As quiet as lying still in soft green grass in a meadow by a little stream. Even when I walk through the dark, scary, lonely places, as the little lamb in the scary, lonely places, Oh, baby. I won't be afraid because my shepherd knows where I am. He is here with me. He keeps me safe. He rescues me. He makes me strong and brave. Wherever I go, I know. Oh, what happened to your Pessy? God's never stopping, never giving up, unbreaking, always and forever love will go too. Oh my goodness. I think it's time for bed, guys. What do you guys think? Go to sleep, baby. All right, guys, so the little girl is down, as you guys seen, and I just changed into my husband's shirt, and I'm wearing some sweatpants, because as you guys can tell by the window, it is freezing outside. I don't know what's up with this weather here in California. It's cold one day and raining, the next day it's hot as heck. But anyways, so now that she is down, down for a nap, not a nap, but now hopefully down for the day, because I don't want to have to keep waking up like I did yesterday. It was horrible um anyways now that she is done i'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes because i want to get a little bit of this place a little bit clean for tomorrow i don't want to have to do too much tomorrow morning so i'm gonna tidy up a little bit i'm not also gonna go on full blown cleaning but i'm just gonna do a little bit show you guys what i do and then show you the rest of my night i guess <music> If 
I turned you into a song Tell me would you love me Tell me everything I should do to get you to love me If I risked it all for you now, tell me would you love me? Oh, cause I can see it, the pain of like how it is right now never like the only reason emma is asleep so early is because honestly she was up all night yesterday and like i just said i did not get any sleep she barely slept and she barely napped today so i am like praying 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 that she does not wake up tonight and that i get to read the bible right now honestly i honestly do not have this time ever like ever so my husband's always here by this time and it's just like on the go, 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 go until it's bedtime. And um, after, I'm usually updating and like uploading and editing and all that stuff right now at night. But right now I just want to relax and read my Bible. I'm going to make myself a cup of coffee and then I'm going to go ahead and read. And then I'll edit tonight before I go to bed. Um, I'll crawl in bed with Emma because Emma's going to sleep with me tonight and um, put my headphones on and edit on my phone because I do editing on my phone. But right now I do want to read. So I think I'm going to start in Psalms also since I read Emma Little Psalms today from that book. I think that's the part of the Bible I'm going to read today and then see where else it leads me. Kind of excited to read my new journal Bible. I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> Like it's going to be any different, but I'm saying like, you know, like writing down little notes and stuff like that. But yeah, let's go ahead and make my coffee. Too much fear has occupied my space. The only cure it lies between your face. Those lips, those eyes, I just die inside.
Oh, there goes my night, guys. I think she's teething. Because look at her little red cheeks. So. I guess good thing I got their cup of coffee because it's going to be a long night for mama. giving her a bottle she doesn't want it i've given her tylenol I don't know. oh my goodness it's okay baby it's okay i don't know what's hurting her guys so at my house like a huge fever um i don't have a thermometer i can't find it anywhere of course and the one that i found has no battery so i had to run to my next door neighbor to see if if, if she had one and <sighs> she did have one but emma did not let me take her temperature because it's the one with the ear and man she was just freaking out forever so my mom's on her way right now because i tried calling the er the er was like oh no you have to bring her in and didn't, wasn't really much help and I don't wanna take her in if they're just gonna do what I'm doing. So I'm just, the neighbor has like a lot of grandkids and she says that whenever they get a fever just to put him in like um, lukewarm water. So she's in the bath right now, but her face is so red and cheeky, but at least she is calming down cause she was freaking out. I mean, screaming like crazy. And then Anthony is not here today. So of course that happens when I'm solo, right? And when I have no help. So I'm freaking out by myself. You okay, my little bear. Look at her little fish. She's so sick. I'm a bear. Baby. Are you okay, pretty girl? No, oh, look at those eyes. Poor baby. My mom's here with Emma while she's in the bath. But I think it's because our window right here, it's super big and all the air down here you can feel all the air down there so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put like this blanket on top of the whole thing because we don't have any curtains and try to like block the air and then i'm gonna put like pillows all the way to the bottom so it can block that vent because i think that she's starting to get first of all i think she's teething and i think she's starting to get a cough and um fever and all that because the air is coming in i think her throat's starting to get um like that so i'm gonna try to put that there and then see if it works <laughs> to the rescue. Mira, la carita. se le miran los labios de Anthony ahorita sí. Ah, 
Yeah, now you want to watch TV. Ahora sí, ya. Le pondré su cartoon. All right, guys. Okay, guys, so um, it is about 10.45. My mom just left, and Emma finally fell asleep. I put her down next to me in the bed. I'm just going to wash off my face and then just call it a night. I was not able to read the Bible, obviously, but I just feel so bad that Emma's so sick right now. She's feeling a little bit better. Her fever went down, so that's a good thing. I'm just hoping that she's a little bit better um, tomorrow. And you guys saw that I put the covers on, on the um, room and stuff. So hopefully that's going to help keep the cold away. And then I turn on the heater because it's kind of cold today. So I just really hope she wakes up a little bit better tomorrow. And I hope she doesn't keep waking up throughout the night. Like I said, I did not get any sleep last night. I got like two hours of sleep. So hopefully um, today it's a little bit better because I did give her Tylenol for the cough and it was nighttime Tylenol so maybe they'll keep her asleep throughout the night. So I'm just going to wash my face and go to bed. Um, I'll probably read the Bible in the bed on my phone. That way I don't have to wake up Emma or be out here and then risk her waking up. Um, at least if I'm right next to her I could read it on my phone and yeah um that is it for today's vlog guys i hope that you guys have a great rest of your day and this vlog definitely did not turn out the way i wanted it to be i wanted it to be a nighttime routine but it went south real quick but um i'm just going to show you guys what really happened and how i went down and it's probably going to be a really really short vlog because of it but anyways <sighs> Hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys next time in my next video. Bye.